10, 10, 10, 33 on the clock Song, 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 glasses on, moving down the block Crowds in the skies for the good luck Circles on the fields make me wanna rock So good evening, I'm sitting here with uh, Dietzel, also known as Le Truc uh, Pioneer in rap music in Russia I'm real privileged to sit here this evening with him before he has his uh, show tonight And uh, thank you for sitting down with me, I appreciate it Nice to see nice you. To meet you. Yeah. So uh, welcome to Muine, lineup bar. Tell me what brought you here. Um, my show, uh, because like it's the first time I perform in Vietnam. I was performing um, four years in a row in in, in uh, Thailand in huh? Samui and Pangan uh, and uh, Phuket. Nice and, places. Yeah. <laughs> like this year we 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 tried. Vietnam, yeah, and, and um, probably the club is gonna be packed, so we're gonna, so we're gonna do it, I think, a couple of times. Nice. After. Oh, really? Nice. And yeah. so we'll see you again. Yeah, probably. What do you think of the venue? Um, I think it's a nice. Place. I actually like places uh, near the sea. It's mm -hmm. a, a special vibe, you know. Mm -hmm. Especially, I do some reggae music also. I do some dancehall music also. So it's a right place to do it. You know. Is there anything you don't do? Uh, I do everything. You do everything. Yeah. Yeah. Life, okay. life is, is so different. But I like, I like biology. I like, um, I like space. Um, I like um, magic. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Does all of that come out in your music? Yes. Okay. And um, I like to talk about it, and I like philosophy also. And um, I don't know, I like uh, educating. Myself with some new languages and stuff. So good for you. Yeah, because because um, you know we live on one planet. We're supposed to understand each other. You know, if we're gonna understand each other, how we're gonna work out? Uh, what would you say is the, the good way? Core message of your music. Um, is peace, love, and happiness, and that uh, the world is like a mirror. So everything you do to other people. Um, probably it will come back mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and everything that you do in your life the world is giving you back the mm -hmm. reflection you've experienced of, that uh, the reflection of your uh, how you call it or how you think mm -hmm. okay. so the way you live everything that comes in is only the way you think tell me about your fan base you were talking earlier about how people respond to your music and the kind of people that do listen to your music um, I started 15 years ago, and uh, on that, that time on TV, we didn't have any um, young hip hop artists. It was like it was something new. Okay. okay? And uh, generation didn't have no um, okay, musical hero or something like that. Okay. And so I was young, and um, dreadlocks and high guy, you know. And it's, um, um, tough, you know, on interviews and stuff okay. like that. And so youngsters, they thought that they thought this closeness, they felt this closeness to my uh, uh, personage. But you know, stuff started changing in some way because um, I started. When my father was my producer, so and and, and uh, I didn't want to do no music. I didn't want to become star. So I I just wanted to dance break dancing. You know, oh. I like break dancing, and I started from from going to breakdancing school and then um, the, the guy was cheap, who was teaching me he was actually dancing all the time with the uh, the main main the first main group in, in Russia at that time I yeah. told you I was not the first one sure and so there were, were some people doing some hip hop and those guys they called Bad Beat uh, Bad Balance and, and then um, the guy who was teaching us to dance, he was dancing with, uh, with, with them, uh, performing on shows and stuff like this. And so he, then the vocalist came in and he said, well, we work with your father and we wanted to try do a song. Would you like to do a song? I said, well, why? okay, I'm young, okay, I'm 16 years yeah. old, okay, so everything is interesting. Sure. I said, okay, why not? Let's do it. Mm -hmm. And so um, we did it, we recorded the song. Um, also, uh, the lyrics that was written by another guy, because at that time I didn't write no lyrics. Okay. I started writing after the like first album came out, and the, all after all albums after saw my lyrics. What was your first song? 
Uh, it was Friday. It was called Friday. Okay. It was it was about me going out to party on Friday. You still do it? Um, I now I work on Fridays. I don't party. <laughs> so you can't sing I do that anyway. parties. Yeah, and uh, it was like about me going out on parties, doing break dance, running from uh, uh, guards in the club, and uh, getting in the club through the back door and stuff like That's this. That's funny. So it was a uh, um, you know original youngster story. Right, okay? right. And then we recorded that first song, and my father had a connection with MTV at that time, big one, because they're a company that worked with uh, two musical channels, and they worked with uh, a lot of music, pop music. And um, they didn't know how to move uh, with hip hop. Okay, so it was a uh, first experience for them, for the big mm -hmm. company, to sign some rap artists yeah. and start moving the and start start moving all the stuff. Um, were shooting a lot of videos, like uh, nearly every song was with video, mm. and they were showing it a lot on TVs against politics, you know, about parties, and you know, it was a revolutionary movement. Okay. Okay. And, and you had a lot of people ready for this kind of yeah music. As I told you, the the youngsters didn't have anything to listen to. Right. Yeah. It's only American stuff, uh, French stuff, or some stuff that is produced in Russia, but it's all mostly pop. It's, it's not really conscious music. So you were going a lot of places no one had ever gone before. Yes. If would. you look back now, what would you do differently? Um, I don't like I don't like to, I don't like to think that I would do something different. You okay. know, it's my experience. I like you know? that. Um, I look at my background, my life before. I look at it like a movie or a cartoon. It wasn't me. You know, it was it, it, it was different me. Okay. And as though I stayed the same. Mm. Okay. Life moved around you. Yes, and then it was like I told you the way I think. You know the things I think about. You know the world gives me more and more information. The world gives me more and more people to understand um, and find a path paths to this to my um, how you call it um, find a way to to the final point. Okay, and the final point is about the final point is about. Um, my music that I wanted all people in the world to to hear it and understand it. Okay, uh, doesn't matter. I don't be like um, show, shown on TV a lot and stuff like this. But you got those musicians, okay, that um, stayed underground, but everybody knows about them. Okay, I'm not talking about like so not fame. You wanna you wanna change the world. I wanna I wanna talk about things. I yeah. wanna connect people. I wanna say that it's near everywhere is the same. You know, we got. In the big cities, it's like uh, it's like um, paradise and hell. And uh, small cities, like island island cities and stuff like that, is hell in paradise. If you if you look inside, the things going down. Okay. I like the way you think. And, and because I travel a lot, I travel in Jamaica, you know, uh, Singapore, Bali, you know, like America, Mexico, and go all over the all over the world. And and the problems people face are nearly the same. And what I think is everything is, you know, the fish start, starts getting bad from the head, okay? The fish? Okay. Yeah, yeah. You know, fish rottens from the head or what, um, something like Maybe this. Maybe that makes sense. I, I've yeah. never heard that, but I like it. So, fish starts getting rotten from the head, okay? Okay. All right. From from the lungs. Okay. Okay. And so this is about the governments. Okay. 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 Because they're supposed to show and uh, be as... Um, Set good examples, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Because if you want to be politic, you want to be all the time seen and doing something good for the people, you got to be uh, transparent. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Are you? Me, yeah, but, you know, for me, I like to be transparent with people because you know, as soon as you get this, you know, um, they feel you better, okay? And then what I do, I sing about it. Nice. Everything I do, I sing about it. What time are you going to start tonight? Uh, it's 10 o'clock, 10 in the evening. What are you expecting? Expecting a lot of people. Uh, I, actually, on my shows, there's uh, people come from all over the places, and some people meet each other like we didn't see each other for ten years. You oh, know? I see. Nice. Yeah, and they come. Like, oh, I didn't see you for so long. That's cool. That's that? cool. And people meet on my um, concerts. Sure, yeah. that must give you. Because in, today there's people coming from uh, Thailand, people coming from Malaysia, people coming from for the concert. Awesome. And you did that. You brought those guys together. 
it's actually who are, who was organizing who who believed in it because you know it's hard to talk with people because they think if I'm not on TV right now okay that I'm not so popular and you know not not many people will come but you know I had I had a whole generation and yeah. the new generation is coming up and I've been on the top there then and I'm on the top now so if you ask somebody in Russia call me like five most known rappers right now they gonna call my name for even sure. young people even young people so your music transcends generations or yes. did you change your music no probably probably transcends generations so I talk about the generation problems I grew up I talk about you know, things I grew up with and I'm living with okay that's good and it still sounds the same to people yeah and people like the new stuff because they some of them they didn't hear my stuff for a long time and then they go come back to the stuff and they whoa they're like it's yeah. new and brand new because at, at, back at the time it sounded for me it sounded very childish but mm. it was quality it was everything was made nice mm -hmm. but it was too childish I wasn't professional at that time okay mm -hmm. uh, I, I was learning while doing stuff okay? yeah so and now you got it yeah now I got it now I you know stopped shaking before the before the shows and stuff like this because because like 10 years in a row, I was like, every time before the, I was going on stage, I was like, just really getting nervous. this energetic wow. and, um, shakedown. <laughs> yeah, shakedown street, I like that. If you see this sign, yes. this is this is Rasta Mafia, this is what my movement. Okay. Okay, this, is what, right. I, this is what I do. This Rasta, is, I Mafia, promote, promote yeah. Rasta Mafia. Blood clad. <laughs> yeah, man. And so we're, yeah, and um, we have partners in Jamaica, we have partners in the in States, we have partners in Europe, uh, we have partners in Asia and it's moving all around and the Russian community is big but the main goal is the to get other people from other countries, from mm -hmm. other communities. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's why I do some stuff in English and most of the people that listen to my stuff they, they go like, Why don't you do everything in Russian? I'm like, well, I don't want to. I want I want other people to hear it also. I don't want to stay local. It's not good, you know. Yeah, good for to you. erase the borders. Mm -hmm. Good for you. Do you sing in any other languages? Russian, yeah. English, and Russian, English, and Patois. Really? Yeah. How did you? Just books and uh, and talking to some uh, Jamaican guys. Good for you. <laughs> wow. So I don't understand like everything when they talk in, in the villages, but um, most of the stuff. Yeah. Okay, I want to hear some. You do some of that tonight? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Patois? Just, yeah, yeah. Very nice. Right. Dance hall. Looking forward to it. I have a whole album. It's called Dance Hall Mania. So if you're interested, you can check out Dance Hall Mania on okay. iTunes. All right. And, um, English songs. It's all songs. in English. All right. And it's all with reggae, it's the reggae vocals, and um, I got some few things there. That, uh, I heard you do a little bit earlier. It sounded yeah, really good. Uh, yeah, I liked it. And, and the album is very nice. Okay. It's a way of fun of the time, okay? People in Russia, they don't understand that music and probably will never understand. There because you go. now the situation is not about, nobody thinks about music now. Yeah. Everybody thinks about money and politics now. Yeah. Today, not tomorrow. Maybe oh. yesterday. <laughs> Well, thank you so much. I really appreciated this uh, time you thank spent you. with me, and it was nice talking to you. And you sound like a real legitimate person, a real sincere guy. I like that. And it comes out in your music, and I think everybody hears it. And I do too. So that's awesome. Good for you. Good for you. Thank much you. success to you. Yeah. Respect Thanks yourself. Respect the others. on the clock. Sunglasses on, moving down the block